make sure that you have your uh, tickets in the drum. $250 cash, courtesy of Attorney's Bookkeeping Service. A good crowd turned out for the 2010 Business Showcase this year. Both visitors and businesses were taking a look at what the Imperial Valley has to offer. Here we are at the annual Imperial Valley Joint Chambers of Commerce uh, Expo. You know, this is a fundraiser so that the Joint Chambers can do things in the community. It's a wonderful event. We're in the Joint Chambers booth with the Brawley uh, Chamber of Commerce and with the City of El Centro Chamber of Commerce. We had some people from Hopeville come by. It's a great place to bring the Valley together, all the business uh, representatives, and it's just fun to be here. It's like a family reunion. We do it every year, and this is our family reunion. I'm Kathleen Pipkin from El Centro Regional Medical Center and we're here at the Expo to talk about El Centro Regional and that we are a community of care and that you can count on us when you need help. My name is Guadalupe Heredia and we're here at the Expo uh, presenting our services from El Centro Regional Medical Center. We do have a diabetes education program. It is a certified and registered program with the American Diabetes Association. There is a high prevalence of diabetes in the Imperial County and in the rest of the nation. So we're here to bring information forth to all people that are attending today in hopes that we can make an impact in the perils of diabetes. We're here at the Business Showcase showcasing some of our programs that we have at the Redevelopment Agency. We have the Facade Improvement Program, a Revolving Loan Fund Program, a Micro Enterprise Loan Program. We have housing programs. We have a lot to offer the citizens of El Centro. Hi, I'm, I'm Maritza Nunez, I'm with EW Corporation and we are proud to be here at the Business Showcase 2010. Um, we recently moved to Al Centro and we are proud to be there and that's why we're here. We'd like to feature our new building and all of our new capabilities. 